Here we're looking at a common route at Newcastle under Lyme and that is following the signs to stone. Okay, so you'll be coming up Campbell Road. It's a left at this roundabout. There's two ways of doing this. So if you have a look, first of all, we are going left, but we're following the, the signs to stone. So in the left lane, but stone is over in the right. So you'd have to check your mirrors and, and get over to your right lane, which is fine, but it can be a bit tight if there's lots of vehicles. Or you can try it this way. So again, following the signs to stone, but keep near the white line. So that puts you in the right part of the roundabout. So you're still going left, but you'll actually see that you are now in the right hand lane. No need to get across. It's just um, a way of managing safety and meaning that you don't really have to cross over lanes, change lanes. Okay, so now there's going to be another roundabout coming up. And at this roundabout, you're going to go right third exit. So you just stay in this right hand lane. Um, can be quite a busy roundabout this one. And that's it, we're going round to your right. So it's first exit, second exit. Make sure here you get your middle mirror, left mirror in, and then signal left over to the left lane. There's a speed change here, and these sign meaning that the right hand lane is closing down. So you've got these deflection arrows here. Really important, you'll notice on the right, you can see solid white lines do not cross. Okay, but people are tempted to cross here when the chevrons go, but here still solid. Do not cross until you get to this part and then over into your right hand lane. Now we're going to follow the signs for Trent Vale. So we keep in the left okay but the white line we keep that just sort of running alongside it so running alongside the the white line which then puts us perfectly in the middle lane like here so we're right in the middle lane so here the left lane is just for going left but the middle and the right hand lane are actually both going straight there is no right on the no right indicated on it so we use that rule which is two lanes going the same direction keeping the left this then takes us on to the next bit and you now should be able to see two arrows both going right so we use our rules keep in the left of the two that puts us here in a nice safe place once we get to this point we check our middle mirror left mirror give a signal left here and yes do give a signal and then away we go down here. So this is quite common to get brought up in tests. And if you follow this structure, using your knowledge on signs and road markings is actually pretty easy. Okay, thank you.